Hi, in this video we'll install Codeblocks IDE as a programming environment for the C programming language. First, open up a browser and search for Codeblocks. Click on Codeblocks in the search results. It should be the very first result. Once there, click on the downloads link on the left hand menu. Now click on download the binary release. Here it will be presented with builds for different OS's and installer types. We'll be installing on Windows and in order for us to be able to compile and build programs using C, we'll need a compiler slash debugger bundled with the installer. Click on the link ending in the mingwsetup.exe. Download the file from either mirror and run the installer. I've already downloaded previously so I'll just run the installer instead. On Windows you'll get a UAC prompt asking if you trust the installer. Just click yes and click through the installation wizard that pops up afterwards. Once the installation is completed, just click yes to the prompt that asks if you want to run code blocks after installation. The IDE will open up with this intro page loaded up. Just click on the create a new project link to start a new project. Select console application as the type of project you want to create and click go. Click on next at the prompt and select C as the language you want to use. Give the project a name and select the folder location if you so choose. Click next. Here you can select the compiler to use. It should be set to GNU GCC compiler by default. Leave the rest of the settings at default and click finish. If the IDE opens up without displaying the project as you see here, check the menu on the upper left hand side which should say management. Click on the tab that says projects and you should be able to see your new project. Click on the plus sign next to sources and double click on main.c. This is the main entry point into your program. There is some sample code that outputs hello world to the screen. Click on build on the main menu and then on build and run. The message hello world will now be printed in the console window. And there you have it. Your development environment is now set up for learning the C programming language. If you like this, please hit the like button, share the video and subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much for watching.